That wisdom must be kicking in. I want to share this with you guys. While I'm chilling in bed. Y'all ain't going to see me though. Now I had a doctor's appointment today and uh everything went well and on my way home you know at this point I was starving I didn't even eat breakfast before I left the house so I said let me go over here to Jack in the Box so as I went to Jack in the Box, I, you know, I placed my order or whatever. I was sitting at a table, you know, just minding my own business. And there was a staff, like, it was like two, like, how should I say it? Like coordinators, right? There were supervising I'm not going to call people retarded it was like a line of students that were like mentally delayed and um, they all were in a group and they were like sitting like a you know, across from me, like a couple of tables down. And, um, you know, one person in the group, it was probably like maybe, I say about like, eh, maybe five students at the most, five or six students. And, um, <clears throat> I want to show you where I know that my wisdom is kicking in now. Knowing that I'll be 41. But this wisdom is starting to kick in because I use my noggin. Instead of doing what I would normally do, like in my 20s, <clears throat> instead of firing on somebody or slamming their face into a, a table or, or throwing them through a window, I kept my cool and didn't even react. Here's the scenario. Once I got my food and I was sitting at the table eating, just the noise, one person in the group kept making this noise and they were talking. You couldn't really hear what they were saying through their delayed speech. So they just kept going, and excuse me for being very uh, animated, but the dude, he kept going, ah. the guy kept going, ah. Ah. <laughs> like that, right? It was this Mexican dude, it looked like he probably was in his mid to late 30s. So the little short guy, he kept making that noise and I kept eating my food, but I wasn't paying attention at all. I just was just like minding my own business. And I swear I felt this aura. I felt like, watch, when this staff leaves, they got to pass me to go through the exit door if they're going across 7th Street. So they're going to have to come my way. I said, watch. In my mind, I swear, you guys, I was thinking as I said, watch when he leaves out. Watch. And then when the dude leaves with the group, I guarantee you he going to do some stupid shit. That's what I was thinking in my mind. Watch. I said, he going to do something stupid. As the group was leaving, he walked on my right side. And I'm sitting there eating my food. I had like, 
I had two tacos and I had a junior bacon with some fries and a Dr. Pepper. You know what I'm saying? I shouldn't have had all that shit, but I was starving. So as they were leaving, they all were walking together in the line on their way out, making their exit. And the same dude that was making all that noise, guess what he did, y'all? He took his hand and picked up the Junior Bacon Burger. Just picked it up and then looked at me and made like a like a monkey face or whatever the hell he was doing. He was like, ooh, ooh, ooh. like, like, kind of like making it look like, yeah, this is good. I guess he was saying, I know that's good or whatever, like like the food is good or whatever and then he put it back down on my tray and then I looked at him with a serious face like like what the hell are you doing dude like what the hell are you doing like that like giving him that look and then the female coordinator she kind of like looked at me like more like like come on he can't help it like that kind of like that and I looked at her like she was crazy too but I kept my cool and then they were on their way out so I did a smart thing this is what exactly what I did now mind you like I said if I was in my 20s what I would have done and I know it sounds fucked up I would have took that damn burger and smashed it all in his face. That's what I would have done in my 20s. I'd probably throw a little two-piece, knock him down, you know what I'm saying, put him down. But it didn't even affect me. All I did is I walked right to the counter and I said, yo, you know the staff that was here just now, no, one of the kids in that group that just left put their hands on my food. And uh, I would like a refund like that. Then the cashier said, we can give you another one. And I said, no, 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 that's okay. I'm already grossed out. So she gave me the $2 and change back or whatever. And that was it. I sat back down, finished up the rest of my food, and I was on my way to go back home. But at that point, like I said, I know that wisdom is kicking in now. And certain things that I do, you know, I'm not going to say I'm a pushover now. Never been that. You know what I'm saying? I knew how to handle that situation with no hesitation. It was just like second nature, like more like the guy can't help what he did. So let me just go ahead and get a refund and be on my way. That was it. But like I said before, in my youth, I know that I would have did some fucked up shit. All right, then, tourists, feel free to sub. And I'll catch you guys on another one. Shh, no.